The ACLU and Clark County School District finally had their day in court. They're really at odds over the release of body cam video capturing an incident between a school police officer and a student. 8 News Now education reporter Joshua Pagero was in the courtroom. He joins us tonight from the newsroom with more. Brian Denise, a cell phone camera captured a CCSD police officer slamming a Durango High School student to the ground. That officer wasn't fired, and today in district court, we learned more details behind that February incident. The issue isn't just about what the ACLU can do. We can do this all day. We have the resources to do this all day. The general public doesn't have the resources to be able to do that. Atar Hasibula and the ACLU accused the Clark County School District in a lawsuit of stonewalling and not releasing body cam footage and documents related to this February 9th incident at Durango High School. You can see an officer grab a student from the back, take him to the ground, then place his knee on the student's back. CCSD defended itself, declaring some of the documents need to be protected. As far as the six body worn cameras, the incident report, the CAD notes, the citation, right? We've identified those and we have asserted that all of those documents are protected under NRS 62H. CCSD's attorney is citing a statute related to protecting child records, an argument the ACLU disagreed with. They say the three students involved were never arrested and no charges have been filed against the one teen who was cited. There was no arrests and there is no delinquency petition filed. Last month, CCSD announced the officer involved in that incident won't be fired, and in court it was revealed the district closed its internal investigation back on April 27th. CCSD's attorney says the students were stopped due to reasonable suspicion. A junior at Cheyenne High School who spoke before the hearing says she was troubled when she saw the video. As a student returning back to a CCSD high school this fall, I'm scared. I don't know what to do. I don't know if that would one day be me or another one of my peers that I'm close to. Yeah, now that district court judge scheduled arguments for Thursday, August 31st. But in the meantime, both sides will be filing documents over the next month. Brian. Joshua, thank you. ACLU says it is considering a civil lawsuit against CCSD seeking damages for two of the Durango High School students it is representing. They did not disclose whether those students would attend Durango High in the fall.